Is there a werewolf or a dogman terrorizing the streets of Michigan? And if so, is it possible the dogman has been doing so since the late 1800s? Sounds like local Michigan folklore. I thought so, too. But then someone presented a photograph of the dogman. But photos can be faked. Then that same someone presented the photo's original negative. And now you have my attention. Let's get into it. The first dogman sighting happened in Wexford County, Michigan in 1887. Now, the creature was spotted by two lumberjacks. The creature was described as approximately seven feet tall and walking on two legs. The creature is said to have had a human-like body covered in fur and the head and face of a dog. Fast forward. A man named Robert Fortney was attacked by a pack of dogs in Paris, Michigan in 1937. Now, Fortney said the pack leader of the dogs walked on two legs. More sightings continued through the 40s, 50s, and 1960s. But in 1961, a night watchman for a manufacturing plant snapped a photo of the creature. You're about to see it. The first photo is the original photo. The photo's negative looks the same. The second photo has the resolution turned up for you guys, just for a little more clarity. Now, the security officer stated that the creature alternated between walking on four legs and walking on primarily two legs. So, is the creature in the photo the Michigan Dogman? Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Is the Michigan Dogman even real, or is it just folklore? Let me know in the comments. Here we go.